guys, how are you? Don't I look super cute right now? No. Yes? No? Who knows? So recently, I've been getting a lot of comments about my makeup on like my Instagram and on some of my videos. So I thought I would do kind of a get ready with me video so you can see how I do my makeup even though this is not really what I do on my channel and I kind of feel awkward about it. I like to let my hair air dry so yep this is me after my shower just gonna show you how I do my makeup while I'm thinking of it. So I am starting with a clean face. Yes, I have acne. Before I show you how I do my makeup I will tell you the two products I use in the shower. To wash my face, I just use the Noxzema Classic Clean Face Cleanser. This is what the product looks like. It's just white. It cleans your face really well, at least for me it does. And I've used it for like 10 years, since I was 13, and I'm going to be 23 next month. And another product I love using is a face mask from Lush called Cup O' Coffee. It's got caffeine in it, obviously, because it's made out of coffee, and it does amazing things for my skin. I love using it when I have to wake up really early because it's coffee on my face, and it, like, wakes me up. It kind of looks like poop, but I promise you it's amazing. I don't use this every day, but I do use it a few times a week, and I'm obsessed with it. I'm going to start off with something I have been loving, especially since it's summer, BB Cream by CoverGirl, and it has SPF in it, so I don't have to worry about my face getting burnt. Some days I will literally just wear this and mascara and then I'm out the door. I don't know if you're supposed to, but I always shake it up before I use it. The way I apply it to my face is weird. Probably not supposed to do it this way, but um, this is what I do. Ooh, it made a little fart noise. I'm so graceful. On my forehead, my nose, and my chin. And then I rub it in with my fingers. This is so entertaining, right? No. Then after I have all of that rubbed in, I just go in with some concealer and I'm just using, it's upside down. And I just use this concealer by Wet n Wild because it's cheap. So then I just go ahead and apply it to the spots that I think need some extra coverage, like right here. <laughs> go ahead and rub it all in with my fingers. Yes, I'm using the viewfinder as a mirror. going to set that with some powder. I'm using one by Physicians Formula and it's almost gone but because I'm cheap I will use this one until I can't get any more product out. And I'm just going to be using a fluffy brush from Sephora. I just say I'm cheap and then I say I'm using a brush from Sephora. Sometimes I make no sense. But my powder done I will go ahead and apply some blush this one is from Sephora and it's called rose glow that's what it looks like super fancy I just use a smaller fluffy brush from Sephora to apply that to my cheekers on my lips is the classic cherry chapstick because that's just what I like to do. And I always save my eyes for last. I don't know why, that's just how I do my makeup. As a base to my eyeshadow, I use this little travel size that it looks like a mess because I just throw it in my makeup bag all the time. Um, but it's Benefits Watts Up and it's a highlighter. And that's what it looks like. Today is 
is 4th of July. I want to do something a little different with my eyes. Normally I just do very neutral eyeshadow colors, but today I'm going, this is still a neutral palette, um, but I'm going to be using the silver in it right here on my eyelids for some extra sparkle because it's 4th of July. And if you don't live in America, to you it's just another day, but for us it's Independence Day and we like to celebrate with fireworks and sparklers and cookouts. And so I want sparkly eyes today. <laughs> for the eyeshadow right on my eyelid, I always just use my finger. For the rest I use brushes. I don't know why I've done that since I was like 13. I will just use my finger and put this eyeshadow over top of the Benefit What's Up. that in so the line is not so harsh. I am going to be taking this color that is super close to my skin tone with a fluffy brush. I will be taking this like grayish brown color and putting it in my outer corner. this white color as a highlight under my eyebrows. Then I will be using this dark brown to fill in my eyebrows with a angled eyeliner brush. Because it is 4th of July, I'm going to add a little extra sparkle. I will be using this eyeshadow from Wet n Wild and just put that over top of the silver that is on my eyelid. And then the last things I do is my eyeliner and my mascara. I am constantly getting questions on how I do my eyeliner. Now is the time that you will learn or I will try to show you. For the eyeliner on my upper eyelids, I just use this liquid eyeliner from e.l.f. Um, I've used this since I was 13 as well. It is not waterproof, that's why I only use it on my upper eyelids, but I like it because it has a nice fine brush and it's easy to apply. At least I think so. For me, I find it best to start from the outer corner of my eye and work my way in and I don't just do like one straight line or else it's very easy to get crooked. I do like little quick um, strokes close to my eyelashes. I want a thicker line I just kind of go over it a few times and I normally tend to make the outer corner thicker than the inner corner that's what the eyeliner looks like without it being winged out but now I will show you what I do on days that I do a little wing at the end of the eyeliner what I do is I start right here and I will make a little line like that and then I just connect it to the end of the eyeliner. Ta-da! Then I just go over and do the same thing on the other side. I normally don't wear eyeliner on my lower lash line, but since it is 4th of July, um, I feel like being a little more festive and crazy with my makeup, so I'm going to apply this blue waterproof eyeliner that I got from Sephora like forever ago. I'm just going to 
finish off with some mascara and I use the black mascara from Maybelline, the Great Lash kind. my makeup for the day. Sorry if it wasn't filmed the best. I am not used to doing makeup videos. I feel kind of awkward doing them. But like I said, you guys were curious to know how I do my eyeliner and stuff, so I just thought I would film a get ready video. Now I will do my hair and get dressed. I always do my makeup in my pajamas and same when I do my hair. Thanks for watching, I love your beautiful faces, and I will see you next time. Bye! Fun fact, I wear glasses, but not in my videos, because look, there's normally a glare. My glasses are so dirty right now. Can you tell? Probably not. Wait, yes, there, don't, well, oh, oh. who knows? <sighs>